So up next here at Overcome, we have an eight-man tag match. We've got quite the crew here from upstate New York. Yeah, these four gentlemen from upstate New York will be a formidable test for their opponents. And you heard the ovation for Charles Blackwolf. Oh, Students of Rip Impact here. And Goff's back out here. Well, that arm must not be too hurt as Goff is uh, with this team. Um, can Goff have two wins in two matches? I gotta say this is quite unorthodox, but uh, Maybe he just still got some fire left. Maybe he's probably just so wired from that last match. And he wants more action. I uh, I think it's uh, a little weird. You know, I think Goth probably should have went and saw a doctor. But uh, nonetheless, he's back out here. Yeah, who knows how that arm is feeling by now. So we've got four guys from upstate New York. Charles Blackfoot from uh, HPW training with uh, Rip Impact here in Hamilton and uh, three other gentlemen and Goff as odd as that is. I will say this, uh, Charles Blackwolf has made a tremendous impact so far in his young career. Well, a fiery competitor with a lot of heart. That man has definitely busted his ass over the years to get uh, to where he is today. Absolutely. And it looks like Charles Blackfoot is going to start it off for his team here. It looks like it's going to be him and Dewey Murray. Yeah, uh, Charles is going to be giving up a, a, bit, a lot of weight by the look of it. Sadly, he's in tremendous shape. Yes, which is always a good thing. Power and elbow tie-up. Blackfoot to a standing side headlock. Up over, and uh, Blackfoot hanging on to the headlock. And he smartly hangs on. A one count by Murray. But Blackfoot is hanging on to that headlock. Let me say something about a headlock. Here, these, the hold, these holds may not win you a match, but they'll definitely give you the momentum. They'll throw your opponent off their balance for sure. Yeah, and when you're at a, a size disadvantage like Blackfoot, you need to use quickness and speed and intelligence to get the upper hand. Nice roll through, tip up, reverse arm ringer. Blackfoot into the corner and there's Ted. And Goff is back in. Nice Instagram by Blackfoot. Drop kick by Goff. I don't know if that's a smart move tagging the least fresh guy in this matchup. Yeah, I don't know. They get a two count, but it's still very early. Oh, oh. the devastating boot. That boot almost took his head off. Well, what's and this? Goff is in the wrong side of town. And again, great strategy there by Dewey Murray. Yeah, and that's a big boot. That's a, a big boot, and uh, Goff is in a world of hurt. But we saw this in the last match that he could overcome. Tag. It's Tag Team Wrestling 101, Josh. Yeah, Goff is definitely in the wrong side of town. This is a strategy that worked out so well in the past with the likes of the Four Horsemen. And Evolution. Put uh, that ring in half and keep him in their corner. Snake Eyes. I think Goff might be right for the pickets and right now. And they tag in Murray again. Oh, poor Goff, he needs a tag bad. 
and his partners aren't doing him any favors as he's now getting quadruple teamed. Charles Blackwell sadly getting a little frustrated. A looking mistake by his tag partners. And the referee is distracted with both tag partners and Goff is getting taken apart. Absolutely, I don't know if that much longer this kid could survive. I mean, I don't know how the people here at Overcome let him go out in two straight matches, but hey, it is what it is. Standing Look at vertical. This. Shades of Davy Boy Smith. Oh, big vertical, and he hung on to the head. Floats over, one, two. Kick out by Goff. Oh, I think he's just not running up pure instinct right now. Get that shoulder up. Kid showing a lot of resiliency. Tag. Say, if this kid even survives the snap, so I'll, I'll be very impressed. Yeah. T-bone suplex. Oh, nice elbow. Shades of Bret Hart. And look at that, they're keeping the cut in the ring in half perfectly. Yeah, it's dangerous for Goth. He's going to get ripped apart. Back. Belly back suplex. Hangs on. Belly to back suplex on Goth again. Well, he just keeps rolling over and executing them perfectly. German suplex. This big man knows how to throw a suplex. And the crowd is getting on this guy. Uh, I wouldn't worry about the fans. That's going to come back and bite him if he's not careful. The fell, fell, oh, nice jawbreaker. And a tag by Goff. I don't know why he was directing that at me. I didn't say anything. I don't know. You know, screaming at the commentary. But then, oh. oh, he got his head taken off by one half of the fellowship. Why they would yell at the ring and uh, uh, commentary team, I don't know. Oh, oh, big move, big move. I'll tell you what, Charles Blackwell's team is not faring very well in the early going here, although we've had no eliminations yet. No, so no eliminations yet, but uh, the four-man team from upstate New York, they, uh, they're having their way. Absolutely. I, I hope for Charles Blackwell's team, the numbers disadvantage don't become too horrible. And there's a chant ringing out by the crowd for like Joey. Now look at this. What's he going for here? Almost the hip attack. And an ankle lock. Six, oh, look at this. Middle of the ring. If he can. Alright, oh, He might be able to get out of it, but he's in the wrong part of the town. He let him go. I don't know if I agree with that strategy. I mean, he got his partner in, and his partner is going to destroy this young man. Uh, and this is very, very... Uh, it's Scott Steiner, but that's not a Steiner recliner. And the double... Become really bad at... And referee, the referee. referee Rob Gosling better start paying attention here. What are they doing there? Having a conversation with the new Star Wars film for crying out loud? Either the new Star Wars film or uh, who's having who over for dinner? <laughs> and Dante missing a boot. This might be the opening here. And there's a 
tag. Oh, and a beautiful spy buster. Gun wrench suplex. Needed house here. Yeah, here comes Black Wolf. Black Wolf back in, but it's uh, Goth thrown over the top. Charles Black Wolf is in the ring, and he's uh, jumping up and down. Nice spear right there. Spear, Black Wolf. spear. Oh, well, uh, my apologies. I thought it was an elimination match. So Charles Blackwolf wins the match for his team. And the roof literally about to come off this place. HBW standing tall. What a tremendous tag team matchup that was. And hey, golf is two for two today. Shopping place like Nini Mishi, my serving up every single plate. The hottest in the season, even summer looks away. Cause I got something to prove.